Welcome to this episode of Think, Learn, Do. For this episode, I was kind of, kind of trying to come up with an idea for Halloween. Um, and what I came up with was uh, to take these, all these old cell phones I have and make spooky eyes that I can put in my window to uh, have that spooky Halloween vibe as people approach my house for trick-or-treating. So what I want to do is, is just have these these cell phones hanging in the window somehow. And I, the way I came up with was to do like a stand. Um, and so what I'm thinking is I'm just going to take a, a 2 by 4 for the base and take some of these furring strips that I have and kind of make them up like this. And then just uh, put a screw in the base here and have that up. Then have a couple more screws up here that the phone can just rest on. And then just place this up in the window uh, with some varying heights for some other ones so I can have a bunch of these at varying heights to, to have some different eyes looking at you and blinking. And for the cell phone, I'm just going to have a, I found that if I could just use these, uh, just have it as a GIF. Um, pretty simple. This is one that I made. It's just it's basically two frames. We have the, the blue eyes as the background and then the second frame it just makes it black, make it look like it's blinking. Seems to work pretty well. And then for my testing, I kind of want to make it uh, less obvious that it was a phone. And originally I was going to paint this all black, but an easier idea I came up with is I'm just going to drape black uh, fabric over this and then put the phone on top of the fabric and that should hide everything pretty well. Let's get this assembled. So, let me set something like that. It'll sit up and let's uh, try that out with the cloth and the GIF playing in the background. We'll see what it looks like. Okay, here it is assembled. You can kind of see here on these screws here that I've kind of angled them so that the, the phone can sit in there. It's a pretty simple stand. Thankfully, it doesn't matter how ugly it is, it's going to with some black cloth. So I got some black cloth. Um, I'm not even sure what this is, but it hides it pretty well. And I like how that looks. So I'll have to get the rest of these built up. I'm gonna do three more of these and then get them out in my window and can see how they look tonight. So they turned out pretty good. They look a lot cooler with the light off, but you can barely see them on my terrible phone. But uh, all in all, I'm pretty happy with how they turned out. And that's how it looks with the, the light off. The video doesn't really do it much justice. It looks a lot cooler in real life, but it's still pretty awesome looking. So that turned out to be really good. I showed it off to, some, to my wife and kids and they loved it. Um, so that was a lot of fun. One thing I would do next, different next time is definitely do a different holder. Balancing the phones on here and getting them all set up turned out to be a real pain. So yeah, next time I'm gonna have to come up with a different way, maybe like 
I don't know, even or bands or something because that was a real pain. But it worked and I, I really liked it. So that was fun. Thanks for watching.